Hello well, everyone, it's Jackie from Scrapping Latina, and it's night, so I don't know how this is going to look, but I wanted to share with you guys something I picked up on eBay. This is another part of my year-end haul. Um, it was a seller, lots of nothing on eBay. She was having, I guess, for the end of the year, 50% off on some laces, so I grabbed a few things. One of them that I got was this roll here and I want to say it's uh, 250 yards uh, it was about I paid 14 14 I think it was 13.99 and 12.99 and that's what it looks like beautiful um, and I can color it any you know I can um, go ahead and color that any color spray it any color it's very thin and dainty so um, I was happy with that and then I placed um, a second order with her shortly after her and I just got that in so I want to open it so I, I cut it open and I just want to show you guys I didn't, I didn't take anything out I want to show you guys um, for starters I didn't like this this is how it came and I'm assuming this is the 10 yard I guess it's supposed to be the 10 yards I, didn't, I don't appreciate being like this so that's not a that's not a great you know a great thing because now it's all tangled up um but i think this is supposed to be 10 yards of one that i bought i don't have up the as a matter of fact hold on i think i can tell you guys it was 10 yards of natural knit grim they paid a dollar 74 for this um okay so she didn't send i, I don't have a packing list uh, unless it's at the bottom, I don't know. But anyway, this was about two bucks for the ten yards, so I was happy. I mean, I love the trim itself. I just don't appreciate that it wasn't tank. It wasn't, um, you know, wrapped up or something. Isn't that pretty? So that's the one. And then I uh, she had some flowers. And I think these were like four dollars a package. So I got them in a peach. These are peach and they have like a shimmer to them, that's why I like them. And then this is pink. It's pink. And then I have lavender. Oh no. Is this lavender and blue? It's supposed to be lavender and blue, but I think she gave me two lavenders. Mm. Yeah, she gave me two lavenders. Uh, okay, I'm gonna have to um contact. Actually, it looks kind of blue, huh? But the flower in the center is lavender. I don't know. I have to check the site. But then there's the lavender, and then this is supposed to be a blue, and I think it's a blue, but there's a lavender flower in it. So I don't understand why that is. I'm gonna have to contact her. I think she sent me two of the same, and then. There was some few more rolls. And I, I don't know if this is everything that I ordered. I have to check my... um. Yeah, because there's no packing list. This is supposed to be... 89 yards... Of another... Trim. Um, this is the roll. Well, this is the roll. Let me see. I went on because I had watched Linda Excalorations... Um, haul fabulous haul from ebay and i said oh you know what i haven't shopped for laces in a while let me see if i can find something oh this is pretty yes look this is pretty isn't this pretty can you guys see that this is very pretty look at that so i went ahead and i, I went looking for like you know bulk laces and she had a bunch of other ones but these here were the free shipping ones and the shipping like the prices were great, don't get me wrong, they were 50% off at the time. And I think now she has like a 25% off going on. But I think the um, the shipping was a bit high for me on those other laces. And I figured, oh my gosh, if I get all the ones I wanted, I was literally, guys, I was literally going to pay like $140 just in shipping. And even though they would combine the shipping, I figured it couldn't be that much of a great discount. You know, if each one of those was like rolls like this, you know what I mean? So I passed on those and I just got the ones that were free shipping for now. And then I, I might go back and visit her again. 
because she did have some beautiful, beautiful, beautiful trims. This is another one here, and this one says it's 144 yards. And this one, oh, this was one actually one of my favorite ones. This was one of the reasons why I actually went back because I said, oh my gosh, I just love the way this looks. And I'm gonna show you guys. Let me put it against something so you can see. Um. Oh, hold on. Oh, I guess she was cutting it and it got damaged. Oh wow, I guess I gotta be careful cutting it, yeah. It seems like the first few inches, probably about, it's probably about a foot is damaged. So let me, let me take out a little more so I can show you guys. Um, hmm. Yeah, I'll put it up against this ruler. I got one of those rulers from Michaels. I found one, I found the one that says I rule. The shabby chic rulers that I got me one. I saw the other ones, but I didn't get those. Yeah, the, the first, like the first foot is messed up, but isn't that just beautiful? So, so small, so dainty, so cute. I mean, just like a perfect trim, right? And then I figured I can color it any color I want as well. So I got that as well. And again, I can't tell you guys right now because I don't have a a um I don't have a an invoice. Yeah, see, there's no invoice in here or any kind of packing slip, so I can't share with you guys how much they were. And I think I'm missing a roll because I thought it was four rolls. Um, that first one, I actually bought that separately. This is a my second order. I thought it was four rolls. I'm going to have to check. Unless the fourth one was the 10-yard one. I'll check when I get off with you guys. But this is a peach. And oh my gosh, this came... It's so damaged. Like, the whole roll is damaged. I guess because she used... One of these, I mean, I can't complain it was free shipping, but she used a plastic bag. So I guess in, in the, um, in transit it got damaged and stuff. I don't know. But that's okay. Um, I'm, I'm, I plan on cutting this up and sharing, so. Let me try the ruler again and see if I can show you guys. No, I might not be able to now because this one's actually, this is a nude, it's supposed to be a nude color, but it looks like a peach. Yeah, that's not, you're not going to be able to see that. Hold on, let me show you guys something else. Okay, here's a pink background. And it says it's, like I said, it's supposed to be a nude color. Look how small that is. So small. So tiny. Yay! <laughs> so I got that as well. And this one says it's... Oh, it doesn't say how many yards it is. So It just says yards, but it doesn't say, like, they didn't put the number of yards in here. But there's a lot. There's a lot in here, and it's... Yeah, there's a lot in here. So, I can start cutting these up and sharing these with Scrappy Friends as well. And then, um, Lindy's Stamp Gang was having a an um, end of the year sale. Now, I missed out on the one, I believe, was it, was it Thanksgiving? Ooh, excuse me, guys, I apologize. Was it Thanksgiving, I think it was, that they had 30% off? And I meant to buy something, and I totally missed out being so busy I couldn't um, get what I wanted to get so for I think New Year's like you know end of the year they had a 25% off so I went ahead and I grabbed some and thank you Cindy Cindy Luhu for responding to my email I had contacted Lindy's regarding some colors and Cynthia was so sweet to get back to me so thank you Cynthia I love you girl I appreciate you getting back to me and telling me the name of the colors because now I was able to pick them up I was looking for more of, like I have a bunch of Lindy's and Glimmer Mist, but I don't have like those shabby chic colors, you know, that everybody is using now. And I really like that. I'm beginning to think that's my style because I absolutely love the pastels. Look, I've always loved the pastels, you know, but I mean, when I see like, oh gosh, these people use like, I mean, the Robin Laura, the cards that she's been making lately. Oh gosh. Shabby chic. I just love those looks. And I said, you know what? That has to be my style. So, I grabbed a couple of things. I grabbed the Flat Fabulous. This is my first time getting Flat Fabulous. And I got them in the Beauty School Dropout. So, I'm looking forward to that. And I got the sprays because, you know what? I was going to get the ink pots. And I said, you know what? I most likely will use the sprays. And I can always dip. Becca, who is body scrap together, taught me how that. I could always use my... my I could always take the lid off and dip it in here. It's the same thing as having an ink pot. So thank you, Becca girl. And this is the Go Grease Lightning. 
and I really think I got those more for um, Greece is my all-time favorite movie my all-time favorite movies are Greece and West Side Story so I got these beauty screwdriver and Grease lightning and then this one is the Hawaiian Islands and this is this is one that I love the colors for the shabby chic like this pink here and this is another flat fabio but I don't know what the oh it's called plumeria pink and this ocean breeze blue I think would be gorgeous look at the south shore sand aloha avocado and the last one is magical mai tai I just thought that would be so pretty like subtle colors so I got that one as well and I got this winter wonderland this is one of the ones I think they gave me the name for so thank you girl because look here it is the winter wonderland which is basically like the shimmer you know I got that as well and oh look see I don't even have to use a spray bottle once because it came with um with lids that's cool so I can actually keep it like that and use it with the paintbrush and then I got let's see I got a free gift here these are oh how pretty these are uh, fabulous filigrees and these are the trees so this is cool that brings three in here and then they, they save me a sheet of tips and tricks on using your sprays for the first time so that's great and then I see that she sent me a bunch of she sent me three of the um, sprayers because I believe they're showing them out like something about that they were being clogged or something so she sent me three so thank you so much Tracy I'm gonna need that I actually have to order a bunch of them because I have a bunch of Lindy's um, this is the Glitz for Scintillating Silver. I forgot to add this to my order, but I emailed them right away. And so she added it for me and just added it to the bill. So thank you, Tracy. I would say Scintillating Silver because I don't have this one. And then I got... Oh, here's two more sprayers. Now I gotta pick my most favorite colors and put it on there. I got something wrong. Wait. Oh, these are okay. These are embossing powders. These are embossing powders, and I got it in the Snow Drift, which is like the shabby chic colors with a little shimmer. And those are the colors there. I know the lighting here at night is horrible. And this one is the Drink Me Silly. And I'm missing one because I got something called Nantucket. And it's not in here. Well, this is a Drink Me Silly. And these are Magicals. These are Micas, I think. Drink Me Silly. And I thought they were, you know, again, I went with the See How I went to Shabby Chic. The little light colors, the subtle colors. So that was my Lindy Sand thing. And I don't have, wow, I don't have a, um, they didn't give me a, um, an invoice here either. So I have to check because I thought I ordered the Nantucket. But that's my um, end of the year haul. And actually that is the end of my end of the year hauls. That is everything that I placed right before we hit 2013. Um, I did visit Hobby Lobby a couple of days ago for the first time. I was supposed to meet up with the girls when they opened up back in August. But my son got sick. So I couldn't meet up with Anika and Olga. But I went on today's Saturday. So I went I believe on th Thursday. And I went for the first time, and even though they have beautiful, beautiful stuff, the reason I went, the stamp set I went to get, I forgot to pick up, believe it or not, because I didn't look at my phone, which is where I had it. I had put down, like, I when I watch you guys' videos, I'm going to show you guys real quick so you can laugh at me. When I watch your videos, I make a wish list. So if you go to notes here, here's my Michael's wish list. <laughs> oh, you guys can see that, right? Okay. Yeah, you're not going to see that. Okay, you go Michael's wish list, and then from here it goes to Hobby Lobby, Stamper's Best, uh, D. Oh, we have to contact about the bags. Walmart, TJ Maxx, Target. Like, there's a whole wish list here. But, um, and then I, f I always forget to take out my phone and actually look at it. There was a lot of nice stuff. I mostly picked up some cream and stuff basically for Christmas. But the experience with the person at the register was not so great. People on the dance floor, on, on the dance floor, you hear me? On the sales floor were great and, pr and very nice and smiling and hello. But when I got up to that one lady, she was so rude. So then I just couldn't help it. And I just started being rude back. All of a sudden, her whole attitude changed. But by then, it was just like, 
you killed it, you know, I don't want to hear it type of thing. But I'm going to come back with that haul. But this is the end of 2012 hauls. So thank you all for watching my end of the, end of the year haul videos. And I hope to, oh wait, I'm lying. There is one more. I received an email from a, one of my friends here on YouTube who is Deb, Lovers Lane Lodge. And she mentioned that For the Love of Art was going out of sale, was going out of business. And they were selling some stuff. They had payments. So thank you Deb for contacting me. And I went ahead and I picked up some. Now I'm going to see if I can squeeze it in because this is the last part, okay? I picked up some stencils for them. So, I got the... Oh, I got some stamps. Here's one. It's one of my stamp sets. And this is for the love of art. And I will leave the link below. This is another stamp set. I thought this was really pretty. And then I got the tie-dye stencil in 6x6. The chicken wire... One is the, uh, this is the chicken wire reversed, and then I got the chicken wire regular. This is the mini burst, and this one here is the art is. That's pretty, right? Then, and they, they actually sent in, in, an invoice, so I'm happy about that. I can, I can double check my order afterwards. In the 12 by 12, I grabbed the art is for my layouts. Let's see, art is. I grabbed the brick, which I thought was really pretty. The chevron, and these I believe are 470 each. The 12 by 12s, which is not bad because um, the 6 by 6 alone I think are four dollars in AC more. The chicken wire, the chicken wire reverse. I got the Mix and Match Hearts. That one's cool, right? I think that's really pretty. That'll be great for Valentine's Day. The Layered Stars. Two different types there. And I think this will be great for the mixed media. Because I've been watching a lot of um, Liam Moore's videos. This is the wood green. You know, when she was doing the mixed media. And, and the tie-dye 12 by 12 So I want to get started on that. And the last one is the tile check, check tile texture. So thank you, Deb, for letting me know about this, girl. I really appreciate it, honey. And I thank you all for watching. I hope you're all doing wonderful, having a good weekend, and I wish you all a good night. Adios.